No, it wasn't pre-planned at all. Uh, but but I just felt like some but it, something needed to happen, and I really wasn't technical, but I really wanted to send a message to the team, not through a team, just with some energy. And uh, you know, the rush showed after ten days off. Uh, we're a better basketball team than we played, and then we showed. But in the end of the day, we pulled it out and got uh, really pleased with Tyra Smith, you know, a freshman that uh, was able to post up, score 15 points, and it's really nice to see uh, r four guys in double figures. So I, I was really happy with that. You know, we had six turnovers in our last game, six, and 18 tonight. And that's a result of really not playing, I think, and, uh, and just practicing. And we, believe me, we practiced really hard. Uh, but. Uh, we were a little bit rusty. We'll clean that up. But we gotta, we got to get some things better. Yeah, yeah, they are. And that's what Keith is going to have to figure out, I believe, is that uh, they were really trying to, to deny him the basketball all night. And we saw it last game with Washington State. We saw it again tonight. And I thought he got frustrated with it. And uh, he, he'll, he'll get better. Uh, he'll learn to play through. Uh, a, a defense's focus uh, on him to keep the ball out of his hand, maybe some double teams, traps, whatever it may be. And, uh, you know, he's going to have to be a complete player and uh, be a, a defender, rebounder, and do all the things that help us win. And I know he made two big shots late, uh, but we really need him. And, and, you know, what's encouraging is that we were able to, to win uh, without him having a big night. I don't know. I don't know. I thought it was a bad call, and I'm not going to get into the official call too much, but, uh, you know, there's there's such a thing as impeding the cutter, you know, and you're not supposed to be able to get in the way of a guy going to his position. And uh, that was that was the call. The call the referee made the call. He made his decision, and, you know, I probably said the magic word. <laughs> I like Darren Jordan. I like him. I think he's the official that made the call. Uh, I know him. I've seen him in off season. He works in the AAU back games. I've seen him. All, we always speak, always talk. Uh, so I have no, certainly nothing. I thought it was a bad call. Don't get me wrong. And uh, I thought we needed some energy. But no, that was. It, it certainly. I don't have any ill will towards Darren Jordan. Is that what we made for? You know, it was a night that we did. I, I'm kind of pleased that we only took 12. Really. Because we were four or twelve was not terrible, you know. That we we felt like as the game got kind of midway first half, we felt like we could get it inside, and we had an advantage inside with Tyrus and Paul. And uh, Tyrus was really posting up hard and physical. He's coming off an, a leg injury where I kept asking him, "Are you tired? Are you fatigued? Can you keep going? Can you play through fatigue?" And he did. And uh, really happy to see him play well because we need without Matt Wilms, we need a low post presence and. Uh, Looked like he gave us one tonight. I'm real happy for him. Yeah. Yeah, we want to spread it out. Uh, it, it just uh, the offense that we, we were just talking in the coach's office that we will have to do a little more, you know, with just a brief amount of, of time since the coaching uh, change is that we've been kind of limited. And so we're running gringo a lot. You hear that word a lot, and that's a, a drive game. But uh, we're going to have to have something where we can get it inside. and uh, But I do like the fact that, that we're spreading the shots around, we're spreading the ball around. We constantly are preaching uh, share everything, share, share in losses, share in wins, share the ball, share in defensive responsibility, share in, in, a, in, a, in a breakdown. Let's just all stay in this together as a team. And uh, so that's, that's part of it is four guys in double figures. We had uh, four guys with nine or shots, nine shots or more. So, uh, and we got to the free throw line 23 times. So that's all positive.